Hello everyone, this is Away Lily from the University of Edinburgh. Today I'm going to present my work, Stable Sketch. Data stream processing plays an important role in web centric areas. Like there's a lot of items generate in seconds, and through some measurement strategy, we can extract some key information, which can be used for different applications, such as user behavior analysis. There exist several typical detection tasks. Here I use heavy heater as an instance. Heavy heater detection is to detect items with high frequency, like over 50 in this example. There are several challenges. The item distribution is usually heavy tilt. It means most items are not heavy in practice, and the processing speed needs to be fast. And due to the limited memory, it's impossible for us to track the information of all items. So the sketches, which is a compacted structure, has been proposed. Here's an example of how sketches work. Like one item arrived, we can hash its item key used for different hash functions and locate four different buckets. And we can add the counter in each bucket by the item frequency. So in this way, we can roughly estimate the frequency of our, all items. However, existing solutions are non-invertible and usually offer low detection accuracy and low processing speed. To tackle these inefficiencies, we propose stable sketch, which is based on item frequency and bucket stability, which is a new metric we propose to evict items. The bucket stability means the degree of recorded item variation in buckets. Like if the items tracked in the buckets changes a lot, it means the bucket has low stability, so it indicates this bucket is more likely to store non heavy items, so we can evict them easily and provide more protection to heavy items. More detail, please refer to our paper. And our method also provides high accuracy, fast processing speed, and it's also generic for different detection tasks. Here we show some key results of our method on heavy heat detection. As you can see, our method achieved the highest accuracy F1 score compared with existing method, even under the limited memory allocation 16 kilobytes. Also the lowest average relative error you can easily reproduce the results of our method by accessing this link. Thank you.